Today I'm filming some UGC for a client and thought I'd jump behind the scenes and actually go through the process of what I do to create these videos and why they pay me for them. First of all, I create my space in this case with this client. I don't actually need to be on screen. I'm gonna focus on the product itself and a demonstration of it being used. So I've got myself set up on a table with my camera and a couple of lights to try and throw those shadows off. Now I've got all the clips of me opening up the product and showing my shoes all dirty. I had to wet the brush, I'm gonna do that. Uh, in the edit, I'm gonna cut that all up and make it very fast paced and just kind of chop from one section to the next with no real transition. And now I have to actually start cleaning one of my shoes. So I'm going to relocate to the bathroom because I think that makes sense. If I was cleaning my shoes, I'd probably go to the bath and yeah, get it dirty there. When I'm setting up my shots, I do try and get everything as level as possible. You can always change that in the edit and, uh, you know, rotate things as you need. But obviously anything you can do and set up as you go along is going to be less work later. And it's just going to make the process quicker. I also try to add as much lighting as I can to the scene. Uh, obviously, that's just going to make the product look better and brighter and more clear. Okay, so now I'm awkwardly standing in my bathtub and in the bathroom. Just, I got the shot down here to get. As you can see, uh, the shoes are much, much cleaner. Now what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to go over the shoes two or three more times so that way I can get them really super clean. So when I cut to my last shot where I'm comparing the two shoes, the dirty one and the clean one, it looks like it's done an immaculate job and, you know, really sell the product of how effective it is. I'm back at the first setup. Got my camera set up a little bit different. I'm actually going to be standing in this shot, holding the shoes and comparing the difference. And basically after that, I'm going to jump into CapCut and use my microphone and write out a little script and then just record a voiceover. So right now I jumped into DaVinci to do my edit. So this is my kind of first uh, layout edit. <clears throat> I do have to get it down to about 45 seconds. There's some big clips in there that I will be removing, but basically this will just give me my layout. Once I get this all edited, then I will do the voiceover and just kind of match it. The thing is, you don't need to use DaVinci, you don't need to use a computer to edit. Uh, you could do this all of you, your phone. You could use CapCut to edit, um, to do your voiceovers. Um, I'm, I personally am just doing this because I want to evolve my skills and I want to really, I want to get more training in on DaVinci. And this gives me an excuse for getting paid while learning new skills. Thank you.